This is an Arizona's Family News Update. Good morning, everyone. I'm Tess Raffles. Here are the latest stories we're following from the Arizona's Family Newsroom. Right now, we continue to follow some developing news as a state senator has been arrested for sexual conduct with a minor. Phoenix police confirm the accused is Democratic Senator Tony Navarrete of Phoenix. The investigation reveals this alleged incident happened back in 2019. Arizona Senate Democrats releasing this statement in response, saying, quote, we are aware one of our members has been arrested and are waiting further details and for law enforcement to do its job, end quote. The fully vaccinated senator was just in the news Tuesday when he announced he had contracted COVID-19. We'll continue to follow the story and keep you posted on any new developments. As more schools go back into session and the mass debate rages on, nearly 2,300 positive coronavirus cases were reported to the state health department yesterday, along with 11 deaths. Well, more Las Vegas style casino games are coming to the Valley. Starting today, you can play roulette and craps at Wild Horse Pass in Chandler. Gila River's two other casinos, Lone Butte and Viquiva, will add those table games in the next few weeks. All three properties will also increase the number of slot machines and betting limits. We'll show you what this all looks like in our 9 o'clock hour. And the Arizona State Fair is now staying put. The 2021 fair will remain at the state fairgrounds rather for this year's event. Now, previously, the fair announced it was moving the event to the Gila River Indian community. But those plans have been delayed because a new location wasn't going to be ready in time. So this year's state fair, mark your calendar, opens October 2nd at the fairgrounds at 19th Avenue in McDowell. All right, that'll mean cooler weather, so that's something to look forward to. How about I have 107 today, 106 getting into your weekend. We'll see storm chances return for next week, about a 20 to 30% chance to see storms in Phoenix. We'll also see cooler weather with temperatures falling to around 103 degrees. Thank you, Ian, for updates on more stories we're following. Just download our app and be sure to subscribe to our YouTube and Roku channels. I'm Tess Raffles. Have a great Friday and a great weekend.